G'day guys and welcome back to another VV analysis video. In this video, I will be going over the Uncanny X-Men number 266 coming to VV this Thursday. So I'll be running over those drop times, drop prices, as well as an aftermarket price prediction for each comic variant, as well as a profitability, which will show you on average how much we're looking to make per blind box or per comic that you buy. But I'll be getting into that later on the video. For now, let's get into a bit of background information about this comic. So as you can see here, the Uncanny X-Men number 266 is the first appearance of Gambit and its publication date was on August the 20th of 1990. Now down the bottom there, I do have the uh, Go Collect prices. So 9.6 with 4,853, that is a very important number because it's a very high supply and it's priced being at 350 US dollars. So this comic does have a significantly high value in the aftermarket, especially considering the amount of supply and the amount of versions of this comic at a very high grade. So keep that in mind when we get into our price predictions so moving on into the editions being released to Vivi. So for this comic, we will have 20,000 editions in total. They will all be $6.99 in a blind box format. And as you can see up there in the top right, the drop time will be Thursday, the 28th of July, 8 a.m. Pacific time. So starting off with the common, this one will have 12,000 editions. The uncommon will have 4,500. The rare, 2,000. The ultra rare, 1,000 editions. And finally, the secret rare with only 500 editions. So pretty typical to what we normally see on BB. So now let's get into some aftermarket price predictions. Now for the common, I've got this one at four gems with a sub 1000 mint price of 19 gems. Now I can definitely see this comic sitting around four gems to start off with and then quickly making its way up to around seven gems, but we'll just have to wait and see in the aftermarket. Uh, so moving on into the uncommon, I do have this one at five gems with a sub 1000 mint price of 31 gems. The rare, 11 gems with a sub 1000 mint price of 43 gems. The ultra rare, 30 gems, sub 1000 mint price of 144 gems. And finally, the secret rare, I do have this one at 110 gems with a sub 1000 mint price of 506 gems. So if the prices in the aftermarket are exactly as shown here, your average profit per blind box would be $1.13. Now keep in mind if you do go for this drop and only end up getting commons and uncommons you will be looking at a loss so this profitability actually does factor in in the long run if you do get a secret rare so please keep that in mind when you're deciding whether or not to go for this drop but as i always do if you don't agree with my price predictions i've also done a bearish and bullish price prediction for this comic to show you whether or not it'll still be profitable with a bearish or bullish outlook so a bearish price for this one would put the common at three gems the uncommon at four gems the rare at nine gems, the ultra rare at 22 gems, and finally the secret rare at 80 gems. Now, if the prices are very bearish in the aftermarket, you would actually be looking at an average loss of 86 cents per blind box. So please keep this in mind when you're deciding whether or not to go for this drop. If you do believe the prices will be pretty bearish, I would recommend not going for this drop because you will be looking at an average loss. Now, if you are very bullish on this comic and do expect the common to be around five gems, the uncommon at seven gems, the rare 14 gems, the ultra rare 40 gems, and finally the secret rare up there at 125 gems, the average profit per blind box would be $3.17. So guys, let me know in the comments if you are actually going for this drop, I definitely will be, and we'll be trying to get as many as I can. But as always, not a financial advisor. And until then, I will see you in the next video. Radio, bye.